My name is Andy and today we are talking about a very interesting topic is mobile numerology superstitious. I'm from E2413 and many people have asked me say Andy you can look at a person past present future from their mobile number isn't this something based on superstition? So let's examine what exactly is superstition. According to the dictionary it is something a widely held belief but it is an irrational belief that is based on some supernatural influences. An uh, example, if somebody touch your shoulder, you say it's bad luck, you will not strike 4D. So most people will say this is superstitious. So let's examine uh, what is irrational belief. Irrational belief is something that you cannot rationalize or reason it. Example, I tell you, don't look at a woman's underwear and then you ask me, what's the reason? I say, don't because otherwise you have bad luck. Can I reason it? Of course, I can reason it, right? I can tell you because that's illegal, you'll be caught by the police and all those things, right? So based on that, if I tell you, don't look at a woman's underwear, that is not irrational belief. That's definitely not superstition, right? And then uh, if you can prove his assistant, of course you cannot prove it, right? I ask you don't look at women's underwear. If you go look at women's underwear, you go verify it, then you get caught in the law, right? In the wrong side of the law, you'll be arrested by the police. So it's something you cannot actually prove it. But of course you have to believe me and it's quite common sense, right? But what if something that you can actually prove it and by yourself, that means you can verify it yourself. Definitely this is called science, right? This is rational science, right? So we all know mobile numerology is based on numbers and numbers is a form of language and language is actually something a human influence it is definitely not a supernatural influence so our mobile numerology is talking about you can read your past present future with just your mobile number and can read six areas of your life your wealth how much do you earn and can you keep money? Your career, are you suitable to be your own boss? Third thing is your marriage and relationships. Fourth is your health, that includes your mental health. And fifth is your personality, your character, your strengths and weaknesses. And the last thing is your benefactors. Do you have people that can help you in your life? So this is based on what? This is all based on eating and the law of large numbers. So eating has been around for more than 5,000 years long before language was invented and they are using strokes like the long line and the short line. And it's based on the law of large numbers, meaning that you can verify it with many case studies. So in fact, we have done more than 70,000 case studies in more than 10 years and it revealed to us a scary secret that your mobile number has a direct impact on your life, whether you know or do not know. So now, how can we verify this, right? Uh, so very simple, let's do it on the fruits experiments, right? Example, you write the numbers 413 and 218 on these two oranges. So now ladies and gentlemen, based on your first look, which orange do you prefer? Most people prefer the 218, right? Let's wait to see what happened to the orange on the ninth day, right? You realize that the 218 orange is actually rotten, it's black. By the way, all these experiments anybody can do and you can also do it at home by yourself, right? And then you also can do the pair experiment, you realize that the 200 pair inner, the inner core is actually rotten. And then you also can do the rice experiment from the rice, in the rice cooker, you put your two bowls and you write different mobile numbers. And you realize that the one uh, on the left is, is her mother's old mobile number actually. Uh, uh, the rice after 9 days get a bit sticky, not so good. Whereas on the right is a new mobile number that's designed by our master Lee and the rice is quite okay, right? In fact, you realize that a mobile number with two zeros of rice will be more black. With four zeros of rice could be totally black, right? So ladies and gentlemen, you can try this experiment at home yourself. You can put your mobile number and then the other bowl, you can actually write my mobile number. I can see what happened. So in fact, if you write the uh, one, one, three, one, four on the orange, the orange will be more fresh, right? That's why this uh, I love you 1314 is a very powerful language that couples use when they're in love. You also can try this yourself at home, right? So finally, have you seen a pomelo that sprouts? This pomelo has a nice mobile number written on the skin and after 15 days, actually there's a growth of it, it sprouts, you know. So imagine you were to use a nice mobile number, wouldn't you also grow younger, grow richer? So the key thing is that our mobile number analysis, you can always verify it. Especially we talk about your past and present, you can verify it yourself, right? When you can verify it, of course, 
is something that you yourself will believe your own verification. So how can this be superstition anymore, right? It cannot be, right? Anyway, you can always test me by me to analyze your mobile number. Very simple. Now you can just WhatsApp me and then give me this few information and then I will analyze the mobile number and can tell me whether my analysis is correct or not. And so from here you can see is there uh, some signs behind it, right? Once again, my name is Andy and today's short segment is called is Mobile Numology Superstitious. Thank you for watching. I shall see you again next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.